Well, we won't be able to implement them, unfortunately. And so, you know, the technology will get away from us. And at that point, we'll be falling behind. And so our service, our response times, everything, everything will struggle after that point. Not only that, if we can't afford to put people in those seats, you will have a wait time. And again, I can't stress enough, that's probably the, my biggest fear is that we're not going to, we're already having difficulty finding these folks in this personnel. And so if we're already struggling, even at the, at the level that we are, we're either going to pay personnel or we're going to pay for the, for the systems to continually run. And I don't want to be put in a place where I have to make that decision. I don't think any county commissioner wants to be in that place to make a decision of whether or not we're going to pay people or, or keep our technology where it needs to be current. Um, and if we're put in that position, I w we will be going back to the legislature and making them, make them aware that this is happening. We're being pinched or we're going to have to raise the taxes on the property owner again. And they're not going to be very, very receptive to that, unfortunately.